I'm Natalia Bonner. Do you love quilting flying geese? I do. I think they can be so much fun to machine quilt. In this fun class, I've got over 20 brand new designs teaching you step-by-step -step how to machine quilt flying geese blocks. So this fun class is actually, you can stitch along with me on your own, or it's a great companion to my class, Let's Stitch Quilt Blocks. All of my designs here are actually quilted out on the panel that I use for my class, Let's Stitch Quilt Blocks. So along the top of that panel and the bottom of the panel are a whole bunch of flying geese, and that's where I'll be stitching all of these fun designs. Now, if you want to stitch along with me and you want to use the same quilt that I used here, you'll definitely want to pick up one of our Quilters Piecing Companion Workbook. So we have a companion workbook that teaches you step-by-step -step how to piece this exact same quilt top, or you can pick it up from honestfabrics.com. It's called Let's Stitch Quilt Blocks. You'll definitely want to pick up the 88 by 104 inch size. That's the size that I'm using here to get the same size geese that I'm stitching out. I'm going to be doing all of my machine quilting on my Gamel 22 inch machine. This is hand guided quilting and I am definitely going to be using my machine quilting rulers. So if you want to join along though, you don't have to stitch on the same machine. You can definitely do this on a home machine, on a sit down machine or a long arm machine. You'll just need to make sure that you have the ability to machine quilt with rulers. Also have a bit of knowledge how to machine quilt with rulers and the ability to drop your feed dogs because there's also going to be quite a bit of free motion quilting. Now, before you get started in this class, there are a few things that I am going to recommend. Definitely going to recommend, like I said, just a basic knowledge of machine quilting. If you haven't already, I recommend that you check out my online class, Beginner's Guide to Free Motion Quilting. It's a great class that teaches you right from the basics, battings, thread, how I pull up my threads, why I do the things that I do. So check out Beginner's Guide to Free Motion Quilting. I'm also going to recommend my book, Visual Guide to Creative Straight Line Quilting. It's a great book that teaches you all of the basics about machine quilting with rulers, whether it's on a long arm machine or a sit down type machine. Now the batting that I'm using here today is one layer of the Quilter Stream Poly Deluxe batting. And the thread that I'll be using is so fine on the top. I'm going to be using color number 402. I love that color. It blends so nicely. And then in my bobbin, I'm using bottom line color number 624. We're definitely going to be doing a bit of marking. So I'm going to recommend getting a foldable tape measure and also the blue Mark Be Gone marker. Now, once I've done my markings, then I love to use a misting spray bottle to mist away those markings. Alrighty, friends, I can't wait to get stitching. I hope you'll join me in Let's Stitch Flying Geese.